right, how's it going? So I'm over here watching another, actually I got this off Nathan uh, Nathaniel's Jordan's channel, where it doesn't it may make any sense where you get two women fighting over some cold fries. This woman's name is Alonia Ford, okay? A jack-in-the-box employee went ballistic over some fries, okay? That it was a group that paid for the curly fries. She wouldn't offer, she would not serve them the group of curly fries. By the way, this happened in Houston, close to the Bush Airport, okay? And the group had offered to pay for the fries again. She still would not, Miss Ford, that is, give them the fries. So you know what she does? This woman throws ketchup and, and different condiments inside the uh, inside the car. Okay, then pulls out the gun. All right, and shoots out. Now, from what I understand, that nobody was killed, but it was deadly conduct. So, Miss Ford, and this happened last year. So months later. She uh, pleads guilty, this is Miss Ford, to um, dead, uh, deadly conduct, all right? I don't know what to say, man. You know, like these, a lot of these workers are overworked, underpaid, and I don't know what to say other than this. Customers. All right, don't mess with these food service workers. All right, and maybe you didn't need the, maybe they didn't need the fries anyway. All right, maybe just let it go. I'm thinking if you're going to get that type of conduct. All right, uh, it's my understanding like an argument ensued and it just makes things work uh, worse. It says uh, soft answer, turn of away wrath. Okay, if anybody have the problem. If you're accounted with a problem, let the aggressor have the problem, okay? Because it's always a second action that gets caught, okay? So, I, I, don't, I don't know, but I'm thinking if you're in a situation like that, the best thing to do is to talk to a manager, get your money back, or have the manager to handle that situation, okay? Or you could leave and then talk to the manager another time okay so you want to get yourself you know, maybe you want to de-escalate the situation but sometimes as the victim you want to do what you got to do to try to defuse the situation on your on, on your own all right you're the better person particularly uh, in a situation like that okay you don't know if the condition of these food service workers before they go to work man they i don't know like they are have to slave over that stove. You don't know if they got an argument with their significant other before they came to work or a breakup or what, okay? But I'm just thinking anybody with more of a, an aggressive demeanor, just let it go. Figure out another way. Don't give them their money. Pull off or just, I don't know, get a manager to give your money back, okay? I like curly fries myself, so... I could take my curly fries, right? I could take my curly fries and slide my curly fries right through my little spaces in my mouth. You can barely see it though, right? You can barely see that. Since me being as a gang stalking victim. All right, so, and uh, Mr. President, I ain't getting shit fixed, okay? So you could take down the uh, the advertisements and all that, okay? Quit talking behind my back. So, I'm good. It is what it is. You like my smile? But you need all your teeth, sir. You know why? So you can make sure that you got all your teeth so you can bite that condom, you know, with uh, that date with you and Cartoon Man, okay? Or Roly Poly, your frat brother, okay? Plus, you know, 
those spaces in your house, you can go get yourself some office furniture or whatever, okay? Add on to that no furniture in your studio since you want to get personal, all right? And uh, my sweaty shirt after I work out, I go to work and get in my truck. Okay, I'll be that though. So I'd rather wear my uh, sweaty shirt, right, than be like you to wear a pride shirt with man boobs or whatever, okay? So I got this busted up being in the military, all right, in a training accident. But, but we know what you do, though, all right? When it's time for you to join, all right? So you claim your LGBT status <laughs> just so you wouldn't have to join, all right? See what you all about. So if you want to try to prove a point, sir. But anyway, that's the story about these uh, curly fries, all right, and these death, sh death shots. I say like this. Either go to the manager Pull off, don't give me your money anymore. Okay? And anybody that uh, calls us up trying to prove a point, well, nothing's going to change. I'll put it like that. Okay? So, um, no matter what epithet that you throw at me, being that I'm in this, uh, this pro program, nothing's going to change, sir. All right? So, you can take the billboards down. Peace.